Hey everyone, welcome back to New Content of Side Bruises. In today's video, we will discuss about the automatic transfers. So when you need to move money between accounts over a predetermined length of time, you can just utilize the automatic transfers. In order to deal with the automatic transfers, let's move on to the accounting module of Odoo 18 and under the accounting tab, you can just move on to the transfers. So uh, till Odoo 17, we know the name where automatic transfers, but in Odoo 18, it's just renamed as transfers. So you can easily create your automatic transfers by setting up the name, company, start date, stop date and the frequency. So here I have already configured an automatic transfers that is to manage the monthly expense transfers. So under the description field, we have to provide the name of the transfer. And afterwards, we also just need to set the period by which we just need to manage with the automatic transfers. In this case, we can also set the frequency. It can be monthly, quarterly or yearly. And these changes or the transfers will be marked on, under the journal miscellaneous operations. And here you can find two accounts that is the origin account and the automated account. Origin account is the source account from which the money will be moving. And automated account is the destination account to which the money will be receiving. So in this case, I have considered two accounts which is bank. Uh, and it will be having a type bank and cash and the other account that is a destination account as the uh, shareholders account and it has a type of um, current asset account. So you can set a percentage of amount that you just need to make transfer. The automated transfer account can be single account or multiple account. For the time being, I would like to set an account with five percentage, which is single. Currently, you can see that the automatic transfer is in its disabled state. Now, if you want to just activate this, you can simply click on activate button so that it will be moving to the training state. Now, you can just simply click on compute transfer. As you click on compute transfer, here you can see that two transfers are created. Because currently, we are in the month March and we cannot process the transfer for this month. But in case of 2025, we know January and February is already over and we can generate transfers for those months. As you just move on to here, you can see the transfers will be created for those months in draft state. Now here, I'm going to consider the month January. And here you can see that the reference is monthly transfer with the uh, dates will be given over here and the accounting date is considered as well as the journal entry is also given. In this case, you can see the shareholders account is given uh, and the amount is just 318.90. And uh, that amount will be marked under the debit side. Because in case of shareholders account, it is a current uh, asset account and the asset is increasing. So that it will be marked under the debit side and in case of bank, the amount is just removing and that will be marked under the credit side. Which means uh, we are just taking the amount out of the bank. So as you just move on to the bank here, you can see the bank balance and that for five percentage will be moved uh, into the shareholders account in the month of January. Now, if you want to pause this, you can simply click on pause so that this will be moving to the posted state from the drive state. Now, you can also pause the transfer uh, in the month of February and click on pause and you can see that we can just transfer the amount and the amount is just shown over here. So that's how we just manage with the automatic transfers in Odoo 18 and uh, um, when the next month is over, which means when the month March is over, uh, the other transfer will be automatically generated over here. So that's how we just deal with the automatic transfers in Odoo 18. So if you want Odoo customizations or Odoo tutorial videos, feel free to contact Cypruises. As always, stay awesome and thank you for watching the video.